I chose to major in CGT because there was nothing else quite like it. Uh, anywhere in Illinois, anywhere in Indiana, within like a two or three hundred mile radius, just trying to find something like CGT was impossible. It was all art, you know, 2D, like hand drawing art or sculpture or uh, just graphics just in general, like, oh, I can make this look pretty. But there was nothing technical about it. I needed something technical. I loved computers since I was little. One of my first games was uh, Freddy Fish, you know, or Reader Rabbit, Math Blasters. I was always so entertained by those video games. And so I wanted to do something like that for children in the future for me, you know, like uh, I want to be that person that inspires a child to go in technology. Right now I'm in my capstone project for computer graphics technology, which is kind of like a senior design. Uh, end of the year, I'm graduating, let's see what I can do with all the things that I've learned. And for me, it was just finding this team, this perfect team. It's so difficult to do sometimes. Uh, there's the forming, storming, norming process that you learn about in these team building exercises. And my team just completely skipped the storming process. We're working together so well. We're building a data visualization of Indiana economic data, which people hear the word data and they kind of they kind of shy away. But what we're doing is we're taking all this data from the Purdue Center of Research Development and we are making it into something beautiful that people can learn from, that they can easily use, so user friendly that you're not just getting tons of data thrown in your face, big numbers and percentages, and uh, this is the poverty level and this is the industrial level. Uh, it's just, you click and it shows you in a beautiful graphical form, and we hope to win Best Project. <laughs> this summer, my internship was with Apparatus Infrastructure Services, a Virtusa company, and I was a part of what was called Indie Extern, which I highly recommend to anyone who's going into an internship in the Indie area. All of the tech interns from around Indianapolis get together and they are placed in the same housing and they get to do a lot of extracurriculars outside of the workplace. So that's Salesforce, that's II, Interactive Intelligence, Apparatus, so many different things. I can't even think of all of them right now. But they all get together and you learn something from every single one of them. I was doing web development, but one of my roommates was doing business intelligence. One of my other roommates was doing uh, database work. So. Not only are you doing something with your company, so apparatus, but I was also learning every single time I went home about what my fellow interns were doing and making friends along the way. My favorite student organization, it's Purdue Musical Organizations. I've been in Purdueettes for four years now and I've traveled internationally even. So I've been to Austria, Germany, Switzerland, and France. This spring break, I'm going to Costa Rica with them. I've just had so many amazing travel opportunities. I've been to Florida, I think, four times. Ohio, Ger Georgia, Tennessee, Kentucky. I've met CEOs of companies. I've met deans of colleges. I, uh, I've met Mitch Daniels, I think, like 20 times and shook his hand. And just the friends that you make. I have 300 friends that I could call up right now in Purdue Musical Organizations, and if I needed help, they would be right there to help me. When I graduate, I am going to be a software developer and integrator for USAA in San Antonio, Texas, and I will mostly be doing front-end development work, so design, basic HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and uh, honing up my skills so I can also work on that back-end. When I was in high school, I didn't have these really great technical opportunities. My high school had word processing and PowerPoint. So I would tell a high school student, it doesn't matter what background you come from. You can come not knowing a lick of coding or design or animation skills, or you could come through already knowing Java and Python. It doesn't matter your skill set. We will tend to your needs and we will teach you what you need to know so that you can go out into the real world and you know just use all that information and knowledge that you have. Hi, I'm Ashley and I'm a techie.